Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead. And it looks like we kind of settled back into the hot and dry for the next several days. You can see another one of these upper level ridges extending from Baja, California up into Texas. Likely we'll see some thunderstorms develop uh, at some point this afternoon just to the north and west of us over the Texas and Oklahoma panhandles. Uh, this activity is going to move towards the east and may clip the northern sections of the area later on tonight. Let's take a look at the next few days here with Robin's Toyota Futurecast. And you can see that as we progress our way through the nighttime hours tonight, we will see a clear to partly cloudy sky across the region. As again, we'll have to keep an eye on the northern edge of the Oracle Text. You can see those thunderstorms kind of grazing the northern tier of counties across the region very late tonight through the morning hours, Tuesday morning. And a few of those could be on the strong side as they push across the region. Other than that, expect quite a bit of sunshine once again Tuesday across most of the region. And with the south wind, it will be a bit on the humid side as well. Of course, hot. Uh, lots of heat to go along with that sunshine. We'll see the low clouds increase across the area tomorrow night and then Wednesday. Expect a mix of clouds and sunshine as the dry weather will continue. Now, longer range, we will see another disturbance approach the area as we uh, move through the work week. You can see that ridge uh, kind of uh, um, shifting more towards the east. Notice another trough developing here by Friday evening over the Rockies. That's going to push a frontal system southward that is going to work its way into the region. You can see we will see a chance for some rain Friday. It'll increase Friday night, probably reach its peak, most models showing Saturday, and then we'll see that rain threat wrap up Saturday night. Now this model showing more rain early next week. This is the only model of several that is doing that. So I think our best chance of rain will be this weekend and then most of next week also looking dry as we'll uh, see a pretty good cool down late this weekend, early next week, followed by the return of the heat late next week. Now, as far as rainfall potential, uh, models pretty good agreement here on how much rain that we will receive here this weekend. Generally speaking, around an inch, maybe an inch and a half for reasonable expectation across most of the area. Uh, totals could be a little bit lower over the southern sections of the area, uh, the way it looks right now. But you can see that uh, uh, rainfall totals, uh, most models showing a good solid inch, a reasonable expectation here uh, through the next 10 days with pretty much all of that occurring this weekend. Uh, so your forecast looks like this for tonight. We will see a uh, partly cloudy sky. Again, a thunderstorm possible north uh, late tonight as we'll see lows that will dip down into the mid 60s north to the upper 60s to low 70 south. That includes 70 tonight in Shreveport, 67 degrees in Texarkana. Tomorrow, I expect a mix of clouds and sunshine. It'll be hot and humid. Again, a little bit of rain possible early over the northern tier of counties as we'll see highs upper 80s low 90s north to the low 90s over the south that includes 93 in Natchitoches 92 in Shreveport 90 for the daytime high tomorrow in Texarkana normals this time of year now in the middle 80s so uh, temperatures will be a good to five degrees plus above normal and we will crank up the heat even more mid 90s Wednesday Thursday and Friday uh, you can see the best rainfall chances probably Saturday, but cooler this weekend with highs in the low to middle 80s. Notice the lows dipping into the low 60s here for Saturday night and Sunday night, and then we'll see those temperatures heat back up into the low 90s by the middle part of next week. So all in all, it looks like uh, the heat is on here for the next several days as temperatures later this week likely will become hotter than what we experienced last week as our next best chance of rain holds off until the weekend.